Oh, Mr. Whiting. Little litty bitty Mr. Whiting and my pliers are in my bag. My worry about today is that it's actually cooled down a bit. That wind is coming from the south and it is chilly. Now I'm hoping that's just a, the breeze before the sun comes up and then it flattens out a bit because if that wind keeps out, it's going to make things interesting being a cold breeze. Yep, on, got him. Get out of there. Get out of there. Little brim. Quick change to the oompa. They seem to like the downsize. Little, little fella. Got him, got him. Not a bad fish, not a bad fish. Yeah. Oh, he's woken up now. He has woken up now. No, stop trying to hide under my kayak, mate. Yeah, no, he's pretty good. Yeah, he is 34-ish to the fork. Not bad at all. Woo! Got him. You know, pretty good fish, and he is, I know, he's pretty well in that, in the fat of the lip there. Awesome, quick pick, and I'll uh, let him go. First brim on the uh, top water this morning, that's of decent size. 34 to the fork. Now I'm just gonna take the hooks out and give him a good release. That was a big hit. Yep. We are uh, whiting. <sighs> yep, on. Oh god, that was subtle. That's a little, little brim. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Dusky. Mr. Dusky on a top water, there we go, eh? The old head shaker himself. All right, there we go. Goodbye, Mr. Flathead. All right, so I'm gonna just apologize now, guys, for the glare. I've just swung around and I'm fishing back, essentially because I have not got any bites up here. And I'm trying to stick to spots close-ish to home just so I can kind of get more fishing time in. But the glare, I hope, isn't too much of a killer for you. So I'm denied about it. I was gonna stay on the flats, but I have had no action on the flats. So I am shooting, actually gonna shoot across to uh, racks we fished yesterday. And gonna see how we go there. Gonna give it about, probably about 20 minutes. If nothing happens there, I'm gonna move back closer to home. Uh, use that wind and current just to power me home, uh, that way. And hopefully find some fish closer to home before I have to go. I'm gonna be off the water about 10, 
enough time to go have something to eat, pack, um, maybe and have a quick kit before we head out and head home. Let's do this. Yep, got him. Got him. Get it out of that rack. Oh, he almost done me. He almost had done me there. Holy cow, I am a very, very lucky angler. He is not a big fish either. He's good, but he's not big. Okay, well, I'm gonna straight up apologize for this awkward pose because I am just trying to keep in place and make sure the sun's not glaring on yous. But he, like, he isn't a bad fish. He's, but he's not huge by any means. But can you guys see what he's done to the leader there? He's gotten that against an oyster and just peeled it. I am so lucky I got him. He just wasn't big, he just had me on the run. But, I got one in the racks. So that's better than the rate I was at and not catching any at all. all right, I'm gonna give him a quick shake and release. And he's done. Yes. Well, there we go, guys. I am now on the way back to the flats. The racks produced one brim and a few other hits kind of thing. Um, wasn't the burn that got him on the racks either today. It was the, the slow whine and pause. So I don't know if that burn's quite working. Like, I got a few fish on it earlier and a few hits, but it's kind of died off. So, I don't know, being a sunny day and not heaps windy, like it's there's a good ripple over the water. Maybe the uh, the walk and the walk pause walk pause will work. Will work better than the burn and kill. But I'm just not 100% sure, so I'm gonna keep testing out all techniques and hopefully end up with a few more fish before 10 o'clock. Got an hour and uh, 15 minutes, so. Got to make things happen and make them happen quick. Yep. Oh, uh, he's gone. Whatever he was. Well, I just turned my camera off for two seconds and I caught Mr. Whiting. Uh, he went suicide at it. Insane little hit, not a bad little fish there, but look at that, he went absolutely ape sh** of that one. There you go, bye Mr. Whiting. Well, that'd be right, I um, hook up to a Whiting and just after I turn my camera off. It appears today they actually want a slightly slower retrieve. And I, I, I knew I found it out earlier, I just, oh, I needed to keep persisting with it. I was just trying to power fish because I had limited time. Okay, I've caught some fish and had some hits. Now I probably had over a thousand hits this weekend. Just a lot of small brim, having to go at the surface lure, but then some big ones too. Oh, there we go. Boat is landed. Oh. 